Hey, hey, hey everyone, it's good to see you all back here on this YouTube channel. I'm super pumped. I'm super pumped for 2020. I'm super pumped for the mining profits in 2020. Um, we are back with the mining profitability check and the current situation of the mining. Um, you know, in the last couple of years, there was literally pointless to do a, a mining profitability check because um, the profitability kept decreasing every week by week um, but it seems like we are now in very good uptrend and cryptocurrencies might be potentially bottom out and we could see a nice bull run the next couple of, year, couple of years of course there will be pullbacks of course there will be panic um, as it's usually in the cryptocurrency it doesn't stand still it moves very fast uh, so does the mining profits and what a performance we have had in January 2020 it's nice to see that uh, you know alt altcoins are outperforming Bitcoin and so on so let's get in straight away you can see the, the um, uh, total market cap is uh, 276 billion now and you know if you you know I'm just gonna go through in this video which ones, uh, which of the hardware to choose and which one, in my opinion, are the most efficient. Um, if you are serious about mining, uh, cheap power is the secret for mining, you know. As cheaper power you have, as longer you're gonna stay in the game. Um, uh, you know, from, from this last bear market, um, you could survive with a 5 cents a kilowatt, which is about, uh, which is what you would need to think to get it you know if you don't if you are serious about mining and if you can't get um the power in in this uh price range you know it's not even worth to start mining um you know it's not 2017 where every house miner you know with a with a, a 30 cents of kilowatt per hour uh was profitable in mining um it's not those times anymore but the profit is slowly increasing, so this is why we're gonna check out um, the uh, the uh, mining profitability. Um, uh, there's two websites uh, which I would suggest you to look at. You know, every week, every month, um, every day, uh, whatever suits you. Um, uh, the one is ASIC Miner Value, which is basically an ASIC Miner compare website. It shows you the profitability and also the newest ASIC miners, how profitable are they um, currently. And, uh, and the next one is what to mine. What to mine I like because you can choose whatever hardware you you want and uh, it will show you the uh, uh, most profitable coins you can mine with it. And uh, yeah, it's, it's a very good website to uh, compare the uh, hardware's um, uh, profitability. Um, so if you are just getting into the mining, um, the big thing is uh, what coins to choose to mine. You know, I would suggest you to mine, you know, top market market cap coins. You know, the playing safe uh, is your is your mining game, because um, you know the, the the top coins they don't um, they are not so volatile. Uh, they don't go up or down uh, in value as a smaller uh, cap coins. And so if you have a large electric bill uh, which you need to pay every month you want more a stable income than a bigger gamble um if you're a home user maybe with one two mining rigs you can mine uh, some shitcoin and you know hope for it to go up in value 100x which is possible in crypto um and uh, it's you know, it's you know it can go up as fast and it could go down also as fast um so first of all um you know to uh, mine ethereum uh the best uh, graphics cards um, is the um, RX uh, 5700. Um, so the price recently on Ethereum was, has done amazing, you, uh, amazingly well. It has nearly doubled and uh, it has went in December 18 from 120 uh, to uh, one and a half months to 210. So nearly doubled. Uh, Ethereum hash rate uh, isn't... Uh, hasn't grown as much um, so December 20 was 152 terahash and now it is 166 so it hasn't grown as much and the mining prof profitability is grown by 90% which is good to see um, 
I'm just going to go through uh, profitability. I'm not going to go through risks. I'm going to do a separate video. Otherwise, it will be too long. I will do this uh, next week. So if you want to, you know, see that video, subscribe to the channel and um, contact us, uh, you know, subscribe the also the Telegram channel, uh, what we have. So basically 12 GPUs will give you 640 mega hash RX 5700. So five cents a kilowatt uh, will get you profit. Uh, sorry, I need to insert the uh, power usage, 1700 watts for 12 GPUs. It will give you um, it will give you profit $286 a month, uh, so $347 before the power costs. Um, so year uh, yearly profit is uh, 3.4 uh, um, 4,000, which would be probably year year and a half for um, return on investment at the current Ethereum prices. Um, it could be possible, uh, you know, much faster as uh, Ethereum is still at very, you know, it's about 80% of all-time highs, uh, but nothing is guaranteed. Uh, but I do think in 2020 it will uh, have a very nice performance as there is uh, very big news for it. Um, like Ethereum Classic, <laughs> you never expect watch kinds can, uh, you know, triple in the price in one month. So Ethereum Classic just did that. Um, but yeah. It also another risk Ethereum 2.0 is coming, which I'm gonna speak about next video, you know. Um, so next thing is mining Bitcoin. Bitcoin currently stands at 9.7 thousand USD. Uh, it also has have had nice performance uh, since December 18. Uh, it has gone about 50% up. Uh, network hash rate is also increased. And last year alone is this three times in uh, since, since December 20. It is uh, how much we have here? 113,000 terahash, and here 122. So not that much, about five percent. The the hash rate has increased, but it's still increasing. And uh, there is um, there is. There is Bitcoin halving upcoming, which is another risk um, of the uh, of the um, you know investment on your mining hardware. Um, the best miner to choose is probably the uh, Unminer S17 uh, Plus. I have seen a couple of versions. This one here, 67, but they also have 73 terahertz version, uh, which does. Uh, um, does uh, mine, which does mine uh, Bitcoin 73 terahash at uh, uh, 3,000 watts, which is quite efficient. And uh, the biggest risk of the ASIC miner is that um, you know it's only suitable for one coin, and. Uh, and you know there's no real resale value if there is a newer a minor release and there is uh, um, quite many risks uh, you know it's a paperweight um, you know I from experience uh, ASIC miners has been a big big risk uh, to me so I'm not I'm more supporting a GPU miner than an ASIC miner but ASIC miners sometimes do intend to be very profitable um because uh you know it's more more centralized and you know it's not so easy accessible to everyone uh, so 73 terahash at 3000 watts 3000 watts will give you it will give you a 336 no something is wrong back 3000 not 300 so it will give you 239 US dollar profit a month after paying electric costs, so 347 before your electric bill. Um, in the, and it should take about six, seven months to uh, uh, return your investment, which is, I think it's very good. Um, you know, yeah, it, it is very good. You know, the, 
the, the, the mining profits uh, where you can return your investment. There's very little such kind of um, you know, business opportunities where you could invest into the mining hardware or any, anything else and you can get your investment back in, in less than a year or less than two years. You know, there's very little such kind of opportunities. Um, the last uh, would be the Dash Miner. Just because Dash is been performing very well, it is still um, about 90% uh, down from the its all-time highs. Another big thing is that um, there's a dash miner. It's quite new. Stau U6 dash coin miner uh, has been uh, released recently, which is quite profitable. Also, the uh, um, network hash rate is growing for dash. It has tripled nearly three times this year, and but. You know, lately it has it has been stable, so it hasn't moved much, uh, which is another good sign. Um, and the the price, of course, the price has been uh, doing crazy. It has been tripled since since uh, January, more than triple for the US dollar start of the January, and it's now 122, which is amazing. Um, which makes me think more that we potentially have reached the uh, um, cryptocurrencies uh, prices bottom and uh, um, we could see a nice uh, bull run. So yeah, let's insert. So 420 uh, giga hash, so 2100 watts and the power cost is uh, uh, 005 cents. And let's calculate that. And we do have a 145 US dollar profit after you paying the electric cost. Um, so before the electric cost is 220 US dollar uh, for miner, which seems and also a nice, nice return for the miner. About nine to ten months, uh, you pay back your uh, investment in the miner. If uh, of course uh, <laughs> nothing happens. Um, to the cryptocurrencies, you know, the price stays the same, difficulty stays the same. Um, this this way, you get your um, investment back uh, this time. Uh, but it's very hard hard to predict um, how um, how cryptocurrency is gonna act. You know, of course, there's gonna be, be pullbacks. Of course, then there will be dumps. Of course, there will be crazy uh, price gains like like they are now. Um, it's hard to predict, you know, if the price goes up and difficulty stays the same, your return of investment is much more faster. If the price goes down and the difficulty stays the same, your investment uh, of your miner is taking a longer time. Um, also, if price the same, if price stays the same and the difficulty mining goes up, also this increases your uh, profitability uh, and uh, you know your return of your investment is much more much more longer so there is many things you need to take into the one calculation um, and you can never predict uh, most accurate what you're gonna have um, it's uh, what you can do is only risk it uh, and, but you know making these all calculations you can uh, reduce your risk as much as possible I hope this video was helpful and uh, uh, Comment down below also if you, if you, uh, you know, what, what, what profitability you think, you know, what, what is the equipment. I hope this video was helpful and comment down below what you think, which of the hardware you think currently is the most profitable and, uh, you know, what would you choose? Um, So I hope this video was helpful for you and uh, comment down below that, you know, if you are in mining, what do you think, which hardware, um, in your opinion, currently is the most profitable, which hardware is what you would use, you would choose and why, why would you choose it? Uh, yeah, comment down below. As I said before, I will do another video about the risks involved choosing your hardware uh, probably next week. So subscribe to the YouTube channel and subscribe to the Telegram channel so you don't miss it. Um, otherwise, thanks for tuning in, guys, and I'll see you on the next one. Goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye.
mind hardcore or don't mind at all.